Hey guys, welcome to my second review slash unboxing of a football boot. And this time I'm going to be unboxing for you the Predator LZ David Beckham edition. So the uh, the pink colorway. This, um, this actually isn't an unboxing, it's more of a review because I've already taken these uh, boots out on the pitch. And I've practiced with them more more than three times so this is actually more of a, of a review of the of the boot so here we go just get that box out of the way alright and here they are they are a very very bright boot very very flashy uh, my camera is actually not displaying it this well, but they are more of a light pink than a dark pink. But um, we'll just go we'll we'll just go straight into the review. I got these for uh, around two hundred dollars uh, from WeGotSoccer.com. So go there. There's some very great deals there, very great prices. So yeah, WeGotSoccer.com. Um, so. What Adidas was tr really trying to do here was were these uh, lethal zones. These are uh, five zones that are supposed to help you with touch, shot, dribble, and pass on the ball. And uh, some of the zones, in my opinion, succeeded. Some of the zones really didn't. But uh, here, here's the first zone. The first zone, the uh, the pass zone, is uh, really nice. It's this just memory foam insert right here. You can kind of see you can see the outline all the way around there, all the way through there. But yeah, it's just this little memory foam insert, and it's for that like little more push on the ball, so you can get that harder pass, that a nicer pass on the ball. And uh, this was actually my favorite zone when I was trying them out. It actually really works. It makes for a little bit more padding, and I I really really do like it. The uh, the next zone on here is the drive zone. Might be a little bit too close up, but the drive zone from right here all the way up here. Those like little rub or ribbed rubber things right there. I'm getting up close. It's been on every Predator. Not particularly this, but just the drive zone in particular has been on every Predator. This one is really nice. I like I like how it sticks off the boot. You can kind of see that right there. But yeah, I like how it sticks off the boot. It gives that for a little extra emphasis on the detail, and also it uh, it really helps for a little bit of extra grip on that on that shot or that long that long high pass. And uh, this zone this zone really does work. Um, gives you a little bit more grip again, like I said. Uh, but yeah, this is one of the zones that actually works, just like the pass zone. The uh, the next zone, the first touch zone, those little those little pockets that the little rubber with the air pockets in it. And you can see that really well, actually. And uh, they're meant for more of a sticky uh, absorb on the ball when it comes down from a high distance or is coming across your body. But um, it kind of works, not not that much, but it does. It it really gives you a little bit of extra suction uh, because of those little air pockets. So yeah, it does work. Um, the next zone, the fourth zone I have for you right now, is the dribble zone. And this zone for me, it was too far out. It didn't. I didn't really like it. Uh, I don't actually use it that much because you can. You can feel or still feel it. It's really sticky because I barely ever touch the ball with that because it is too far out. If they moved it over to the right and up a little bit more, it would be perfect. But right here, you you don't really use it that much, unfortunately. Um, it's a nice little effect on the boot, but you really don't use it that much. And the final zone, the uh, sweet touch, the the sweet spot zone, is a. Uh, it's pretty nice. It. Applies for a little bit extra stick when you're curving the ball, but yeah, Adidas Adidas got this one right. It is where you hit the ball when you're trying to curve it up or 90, so that's pretty cool. I, I like it because it kind of outlines where I need to hit it to curve to curve the ball, and it gives me that little bit of extra grip 
on wet playing surfaces and just playing surfaces in general. So that's that's really nice. I like that. Now on to the stud pattern. It is the sprint frame like m most of the Adidas are right now. It's got those four in the back and then that six in the front with the one in the middle, which is pretty nice. It supplies for a really, really nice grip on the field. And uh, I I haven't slipped yet, so that's good. But it it does it's it works well. It it's just like the um, the F50s, and it does work very well. Um, the feature that is on this new Predator is the My Coach. This is very great. I I use this. This is actually my favorite feature of the new Adidas lines, the My Coach. It's it's really awesome. So if you do get a Adidas, even if it's not the Predator, try to get the My Coach because it really is amazing. And now for the uh, final thing, the um, the insole on this. Let me just let me take this out for you. And I'll yeah, let me just take this out. And um, you can see it does say David Beckham right there because these are the David Beckham editions, and that. That little hole there, that's not that's not a screw up or anything. That is supposed to be there. So if you do get these, it's Adidas didn't mess up. That is supposed to be there. And then you can see, because I've worn this a few times, or I don't know if you can see that, but it's kind of formed to my toes, which is pretty cool. Um it's a pretty it's a pretty lightweight insole. It's not it's not as lightweight as the vapor, but it is light, it's nice. And um it it's I, I like it. It's Gives for a little bit of extra padding and uh, really does work. But that's uh, that's pretty much it, you guys. The uh, LZ Pink LZ David Beckham editions. They're very bright. Retail price around two hundred dollars. Again, got them from WeGotSoccer.com. So go check those guys out. Please, please subscribe. Um, leave in the comments what you guys want me to review next. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any kind of sponsor yet or uh, supplier, so I'll just have to buy the boots by myself. But leave, leave what you want me to review next, and I'll try to get that up. Thanks for watching.